We've had many clients who have been injured when a motor vehicle hit them on their bicycle and one of the first things they always want to know is how long will it take to resolve my case? And the answer to that, as with any other personal injury case, is it's really hard to tell. Uh, there are a lot of things that go into uh, determining how long uh, it will take to resolve a personal injury case and uh, some of the most important details are how significant the injuries are and how much insurance coverage the at-fault driver has. Uh, if the the uh, insurance uh, amount is relatively low and the medical expenses are relatively high, uh, those cases will resolve pretty quickly. Um, they can be resolved usually within a couple months after uh, the injured party has finished treating for their injuries. Uh, if there's a lot of coverage and injuries uh, are less significant, those are the types of cases that can draw on longer because uh, the parties don't, uh, don't agree on what the value of the injuries is and a lawsuit may need to be filed. In Georgia, the statute of limitations on a personal injury lawsuit is two years, which means that uh, if you want to file one of those lawsuits, it has to be done within two years of the date of the incident, the date of the accident. Uh, so that is, uh, that is one of the driving points. You have to have that filed within two years. At the point when you have to file the lawsuit, um, there's a lot of work uh, discovering information and uh, presenting the claim, and it may actually have to be presented to a jury at the end. So. Uh, when you file one of those claims, it's pretty fair to assume that it's probably going to take somewhere between one and three years after the filing of the lawsuit to resolve it. Uh, if you have been injured in a case with a motor vehicle uh, hitting a bicycle and you need to know how long your case may take and what you need to do to try to resolve your case, please give me a call. We're here to help.